hello everyone welcome to another beautiful video in today's video i'm going to be sharing with you how to renew your international passport or how to get a new passport if you're like me that wants to japa or more if you japa i want japa i want to come up for this country and you are here in ibado or you live around here or your state you have where you can actually get your international passport or renew your international passport so guys i'm going to be sharing with you in this video how to renew your international passport or how to get a new international passport if you're watching you've not subscribed to Oju or lack space space don't forget to subscribe to Oju or lack space space so this season is season of japa and i'll be taking you through every step of my relocating our um, <laughs> uh, so we are going to be jackpine for those of us that are in jackpine group we are going to be jackpine i'm just using the word japa i'm going out to do some international business and um, to do your international business you don't just to stay in nigeria with your international business you have to move around and so because of that this is the next steps in my life i will be relocating not fully because it's a business i have to do between nigeria and outside nigeria but before that i need my international passport i need to renew or get a new international passport so guys i'm going to be sharing with you today what you need how much it costs for you to renew your international passport or to get a new passport so let's get there guys i've gotten the price the number of pages for your international passport how much it costs if you want to renew or if you want to get a fresh new passport that is international passport now to get your international passport is we have the one of 34 pages this 34 pages is just for five years and for this 34 pages five years is going to cost you for to cost you forty seven thousand five hundred as a new passport now in Ibadan and if you are getting the one of five years 74 pages because their pages varies although one of 64 pages for five years guys if you want to get international pass passports that is nigeria international passport with five years expiring and that is 64 pages is going to cost you 75,000 naira imagine the difference is because we have the difference in the pages of your international passport then we have the one of 10 years which is 64 pages but it goes for 120,000 naira i hope you got this information right we have the one for 120,000 64 pages is going for 10 years and we have the one of five years since the four pages is going for 75,000 and we also have the one for five years um, 34 pages is also going for 40, five, 47,500 so anyone you be, you want to get now in Nigeria you can actually get your international passport this is the cost of your international passport and one good thing another news I have for you which is good news um, they, they've actually worked on the number of days of your apply if you are applying for the five years international passport expiring date it's just going to take you just four months but if you're applying for the one of 10 years um, the cost is 120,000 and it will just it just for applying you are going to get it just in six weeks Wow I mean it's six weeks 
six weeks here in Ibadan, you're going to get your international passport. It doesn't take long. Right from the day you fill your form down to when you be called to come and take capture. Then after you have captured, then you'll be called upon to come and take your international passport so you can jackpot. You are ready to jack back with your international passport so if you don't have international passport it might probably um stop you from traveling in fact it will stop you from traveling outside nigeria so the best thing is you work on getting your international passport so that is what i've been able to get today and i'm giving you this information because i've also renewing my international passport and um, your sister want to jackpot <laughs> i'm here i want to jackpot so you can actually come down to ibadan we, we are not actually though this place was filled with lots of people but not as those people in Iba, uh, lagos so if you felt lagos is crowded you can come down to ibadan and the uh, good news about it is don't say oh for the fact that i'm not from or your state i can't come down to or your state to get my international passport no you can actually come down to your state to get your international passport it's still the same equa international passport in nigeria so you can come around and their prices is still the same nothing changes so guys if you're watching you've not subscribed to jella creative space don't forget to always subscribe to my youtube channel and i'm like i promise you i'm going to be taking you on my trip of traveling outside nigeria so guys thank you for watching today's video don't forget to subscribe like and share and if you've done your international passport recently you can share with us your experience on getting your international passport let people know are you able to get your international passport fast or cheaper as it may as you might want to like okay this is the information i have when it comes to my getting my international passport either when you renew your international passport or when you're getting a new one as a fresh international passport and if you are getting your fresh international passport you have meant you need your nin registration you need your nin number if you don't have nin you can't register for international passport you will need the nin and you need your phone number these are the informations that you must have before you will be allowed to even get the form to get your international passport. So make sure your NIN is ready and your phone number is ready. Your date of birth is also ready. Guys, I hope you've been able to get one or two information concerning international passport and um, if you still have any other question you can put it in the comment section and i'm going to give you the answer maybe there's a particular information i am supposed to have given out and i didn't give out the information so you can just write it in the comment section and i'm going to be sharing it with you thank you so much for watching today's video don't forget to subscribe like and share see you in my next video bye